Hi and welcome to my tutorial on in-flight adjustments. I've done this on my Tyrannus but it should work just as well with any transmitter that it's got at least one three position and another two position switch free. If you haven't already done so, connect your board and go to the adjustments tab. I'm using two three position switches on AUX2 and AUX3 for my adjustments. We need to enable the first three ranges and set them to AUX2. Now drag the sliders out to 1300. then space them out so that they meet each other and use the entire range. Next we decide what we want to adjust. I'm using roll P which we will adjust with aux 3. Next I'll be using pitch P and again adjust that with aux 3. Lastly, roll and pitch I, and again adjust it with aux 3. Next we save it, and we're pretty much done in the adjustments tab. Now is a good time to remind you that the switch on aux 3 should be in its middle position, unless you're actually making adjustments. The next step involves powering up your quad and your transmitter, so I recommend taking the props off. Now that everything's powered up, we can actually see how this works. I've got the switch on AUX2 in its upper position, which means we're going to be adjusting roll P using AUX3, which at the moment is in central position. I've got it reversed so that if you flick the switch up, the gain goes up. If you flick the switch down, the gain goes down. Now if we've moved the switch on AUX2 to a central position, we end up adjusting pitch P once again on AUX3. Now if we move the switch on AUX2 to its final position, we end up right adjusting pitch and roll I gain once again by using AUX3. Switch up, gain goes up, switch down, gain goes down. Now let's move to the PID tuning tab and see it all happen. I'm going to use profile 2 because I don't want to stuff up my good flying profile. Any adjustments you make won't show up in clean flight until you hit the refresh button. If I go up five times on aux 3 and then hit the refresh button, it'll show in the roll P gain. Now if I move aux 2 to the center and do the same thing again on aux 3, and hit refresh, our pitch P gain will have just increased. And in the third position on AUX2, our I gain increases. If you hold the switch on AUX3 in the up or down position, it will keep increasing or decreasing. As it increases, you'll get a double beep. As it decreases, you'll get a single beep. Once you're done, if you want to keep these settings, you'll have to save them, either by connecting to the configurator and hitting save, or by putting both sticks down and out on your transmitter. That's throttle down, your left, pitch down, roll right. Well, thanks for watching. If this has been helpful, please like, subscribe, leave a comment in the section below, and um, enjoy flying.